What is up, PokeFam? Today is the day. Finally, Brilliant Stars has been released in the US. And boy, 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 am I excited to dive into what we are opening up today. And that is going to be the Brilliant Stars ETB. Was able to pick one up at Target. Super excited to open it up. I do have the Pokemon Center ETB coming in the mail. Should arrive soon. So we're going to be diving into that as well. That is going to be my first Pokemon Center ETB to open up. So that's going to be exciting. Stay tuned for that one. But today we're diving in two brilliant stars. We did Starbirth, the Japanese set. But man, nothing. I, I like the Japanese cards. Don't get me wrong. But seeing these cards in English, obviously knowing what they're saying and things like that, being able to break them down is tons of fun. So we're going to jump in. Let's see what we can get our hands on. We got some pretty great pulls in Starbirth. And let's see if we can pull any of those character cards in today's video. All right, so here it is. Brilliant Stars, Sword and Shield Brilliant Stars. We got the ETB. So again, I always like to show off these ETBs. Sometimes they come with different stuff, but most of the time it's the same stuff. But there's that player guide. Slide this open. Now this ETB is a beautiful artwork. I absolutely love the, it's simple, but it's like next level as well. So we'll crack that open. There's the sleeves that it comes in. Toss that to the side. There's the player guide. Hey, they finally updated the player guide. That's nice. Or I'm sorry, the game rules. We have our eight packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Absolutely love the pack arts. We got our new V-Star uh, token, I guess per se. There we go. Oh, the other one fell out. There it is. I got our die. Nice looking color there. I really like those. What else we do we got? Okay. So I really like this side. This is kind of what scares me. Are these the matte finish or are they see-through? I think they're the matte finish. Yeah, see how it's kind of foggy? Mm, that's a bummer. That's okay though. We'll hold on to them just in case. Go ahead, give you that code card. Then we got our energies and our pretty freaking cool dividers. So, enough with those. What we're all here for, which is these. Man, oh man, we got the Shaman, the Charizard, the Arceus, the Whimsicott. Man. All right. Well, we're just gonna go ahead and jump into this shaman right off the bat. Before we do so, I'm gonna grab my sleeves real quick. All right, we got the sleeves, we got the packs right here. Let's dive into it. So we're gonna start off with shaman. Give that code card to you. Uh oh, so we already got some, some something of a little spoiler, I guess, per se. So what they're doing is ever so often packs, I think, from what I've seen, ever so often packs, they're throwing in these little V-Star cards. This is just so that way you don't have to carry around that token that I showed earlier. Um, you can just put this with your 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 deck that you're using to battle. This is for the TCG. So no energies, just V-Star card. Put that off to the side. So we're gonna start off with a Bear Tick, Dust Clops, Cleansing Gloves, Clink, Spiritum, Axew, looking cute, Impidimp, Magmar, love that art. I know I said it in Starbirth, but I absolutely love that Magmar art. Hey, 
already 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 we got a gold card single strike urshifu v max let's go and i think we got something yeah we got something behind it too oh man i i love this set favorite set a zarud v okay let's go doubling up on the hits in one pack so that's good to know that you can indeed double up on the hits I knew the character cards, I knew the character cards could uh, be in that second to last spot, but I did not know that you could get a gold card out of there. Let's go, single strike Urshifu. All right, we're one pack in, and I'm already happy. We could not pull anything else, but because we got that gold card, I'm ecstatic. But that's who we're chasing. That is who we're chasing. If y'all saw Starbirth, if y'all haven't, I'm gonna throw it up here somewhere. But if y'all if y'all saw me open the Starbirth booster box, I pulled the alternate art Charizard V. The one where he's battling Venusaur. If we could pull that in the English set, dude. Alright. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. There's that code card. So we do have an energy right here. Let's go ahead and guess water. Ooh. Ooh, there's the fire. Oh, and these energies. These energies are, it's a new design. And these might be my favorite energies ever. Most people don't get, you know, excited about energies. But dude, these look phenomenal. I like the burst behind it. Absolute fire. All right. So we got the Hitmon top, Luxio, Choice Belt, Gibble, Trap Pinch, Execute, Starly, Shroomish, Carablast. Okay, so nothing in that spot. But what is our rare? A Lipard V. Okay, okay, so nothing there. Nothing there, but that's okay. Like I said, we already got gold. We've already struck gold. All right. So we got our Arceus. What can we pull out of Arceus? Let's go Psychic. Hey, there we go. Let's see if we can get something out of this set or this pack. We got Choice Belt, Floatzel, Roseanne's Backup. Man, you could do a lot of stuff with this card. We got Throw, Shroomish, Piplup, shout out to Piplup, Turtwig, Sneasel, Sock as our reverse, and for our rare. Oh, okay. So this answers my question. I did not know if they were going to do V Max and V Stars in the same set, but I'm glad to know that they do have V Maxes in here. Now, I wonder. If there's more V-Stars and there are V-Maxes, are they slowly getting rid of them? Or are they going to keep them in? That'll be interesting to see. But we indeed did pull a V-Max. Um, so that's that's exciting to see. Now, I know y'all are probably thinking, Dakota, you just pulled a single strike Urshifu V-Max. That's, that's, I call those just like reprints. It's a reprint, but just in a different uh, rarity. So that one, I, I, I knew they were going to do VMAXs in, but the regular VMAXs, I didn't know if they were going to get rid of the VMAX and just do V-Stars, but now I know. If you don't know, now you know. All right, so we got Whimsicott here. So far, Shaman is my good luck charm. So let's see what we get here. Guess the energy, let's go lightning. Oh, we got that steel, or that metal energy. All right, we got Ultra Ball, Crawdont, Magma Basin, Shinx, Bidoof, Electro Buzz, Halucha. I kind of like that, I'm like a little anime superhero vibe. Buizel, Golurk as our reverse, and for our rare, 
Al Creamy. Okay, so no hit there. So that's okay. That's okay. That's some nice art too. I like that Al Creamy art. All right. Back around to our Shaman. See if we can keep the ball rolling with Shaman. See if we can keep the ball rolling. There's that code card for you. And let's go ahead and guess Leaf. Oh, there's that water. I like that one. It's a nice looking energy. All right. So we got Monferno, Staravia, Vibrava, Halucha, Boisel, Gibble, Trap Inch, Cast Form, Dedene, as our reverse. And for our rare, are we going to get something? Okay, an Infernape Hollow. The hollows, the hollows look nice. Yep, the hollows look nice. We'll go ahead and sleeve them up. Go ahead and sleeve them up. All right. You know what? Let's save Charizard for last. How about that? Oh, we got another Shaman pack. Oh, and we got two Charizards left. Okay, let's go. Maybe that's a sign. Maybe that is a sign. See what we can get. Let's go ahead and guess, and let's say Lightning again. Ooh, fighting. Okay, okay, okay. We got Grottle, Gabite, Cafe Master, Starly, Shroomish, Shout out to Piplo, Turtwig, Mencino, or Mencino, Staravia, and for our rare, hey, Empoleon Hollow. Okay, okay, okay. Well, we got in, in, uh, Infernape, Empoleon. Now we just need to pull, uh, I can't think of his name right now, but you know what I'm talking about. The other starter, third evolution. All right. All right, all right, all right. We got two Charizard packs to end it. What are we going to pull? Something. I would like to see a character card pulled. That would be nice. We got the fire. Last time we had fire, we pulled fire. So let's see. Executor. Blunder policy. Roseanne's backup. Duskull. Farfetch'd. That's some nice art. Man, they really got some nice art in this, this set. Execute. Grimer. Sneasel. Staryu as our reverse. We got anything in the rare? Oh, just a Flygon non-hollow. That's all right. That's all right. We're at our last pack. Last pack magic right here. Let's see what we can get. Let's see what we can get. Can we end it on a heater? There's that code card for you. Let's go ahead and guess the energy and let's say dark. We got the energy. Now let's go. We got Claydol, Tropius, Vibrava, Cub Chew, Dedene, Farfetch'd with that awesome art, Duskull, Grimer, Staraptor as our reverse. So I don't thank no character cards, but I could be wrong. They could end up in the uh, the rare spot. But are we gonna end on something? Oh, and we ended on a muck, but that's okay because we did pull some heat. Well, guys, there you have it. We took our first look at the brilliant stars, the American set. Um, that released today super super excited to 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 open up more of this um went looking for it today i could only find this etb so it's going to be a popular set because it has amazing cards in it and the pulls are pretty good i mean we opened up what eight packs and we had five hits i know we got two and one but that's what makes it even better is you can get a two for one and um i think that's that's kind of what people are looking for these last few sets are kind of hit or miss. 
um, like the Chilling Rain, Battle Styles, uh, even Fusion Strike just didn't seem to have what we were looking for when it came to the hits. But I think Brilliant Stars is going to be, I, I know it's early in the year, but I think Brilliant Stars is going to be the best set for 20, uh, 2022. So we'll see. I, I've seen some things that they're bringing out some new cards and things like that. Uh, plus with the the new Hisuian forms from uh, Pokemon's Legend Arceus. So those are going to be awesome cards to grab as well. But I don't think anything this year is going to be able to break to beat this set right here. So if y'all haven't yet, guys, be sure to like this video, subscribe down below, and ring that bell notification so that way you can get an update every time I post a video. Thank y'all for sticking around and watching this video. Stay tuned because I have some more crazy things coming up. But until next time, guys, I'm going to catch y'all later.